trip behind the scenes with future country rock blues kings and queens discover them first with palm mash tv palm mash tv Paul Mash TV time again. Thank you so much for joining us. We've got another great interview coming up for you shortly. But if you haven't yet, go ahead and click that subscribe button and click the bell, and you're always going to be notified of any new episodes coming your way. And you can leave a comment on the comment section, and we'd love to hear from you there. And don't forget, the description part of this interview will have our contact info, and contact info will be included in the closing credits at the end of this episode as well. So I hope you stay tuned for that. From Nanaimo, British Columbia, Canada, for the second time, we have Vince Worry, and he's updating us on some things, so I know you want to stay tuned for that. But first, let's go to a couple quick words from the King Gordon Show and TLC Travel Agency. So don't go away, we'll be right back, right after this. The Caden Gordon Show, today's best country mix, is a two-hour show playing independent and mainstream country music you know and love. Be sure to check it out at thecadengordonshow.com for more information on the show. Ever thought about owning your own business? Tanya Lapsley Cockett did. She decided a little over five years ago that she was going to be an entrepreneur, so she started her travel business. Tanya is married and works a full-time job. Her business has given her amazing opportunities. Not only does she get to help people create memories by booking their vacations, sporting and entertainment tickets, rental cars, etc., but it has also allowed her to help other families create legacy income. The travel industry is extremely lucrative and is an $8 trillion industry. The travel industry is projected to earn in excess of $15 trillion over the next 10 years. The travel industry pays its professionals up to 70 to 80% commission on the travel that they book for themselves and their clients. As a travel business owner, Tanya books travel and teaches others how to own and operate their own travel business. She is a director in training on the marketing side of her business where she has helped over 90 families start their own businesses. If you're interested in owning your own travel business, please contact Tanya at 917-743-1199 or at ladytlc3555 at me.com. Okay, we're back, and with us from Nanaimo, uh, British Columbia, Canada, we have back for the second time, Vince Morey. Thanks for coming back on the show, Vince. <laughs> it's my pleasure. Uh, okay, well, I'm sure there's been a lot of things that's been going on with you since last time. Uh, why don't you uh, recap us on some of those things? Oh, we've had um, an, another single called Dream and Dropped a few months back, which was fun, and then a couple of smaller releases. Uh, I did a cover of... Uh, a Robbie Williams tune called Angels and um, a Remembrance Day song called I've Got Your Back and a Christmas song that got uh, played on our local news station. Uh, it's actually a, more of a snow song than a Christmas song uh, called Snow Days and um, now just dropping uh, I'll Never Be, which comes out today. Oh, okay. Well, that sounds like you've been doing a lot there. Uh, any any uh, concerts or any shows you want anybody to know about since they're, if they're in the Nanaimo? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Actually, on October 26th, uh, my uh, tribute to The Doors called Mojo Rising with an outstanding group of musicians, uh, many from the um, uh, Big Records family band called uh, Yesterday's Fate. Mm. We are playing uh, at the uh, Port Theater in Nanaimo. We're also playing... Um, in Courtney Comox at the Tidemark Theater, a few days around there. I think it's the next weekend. And also at the wonderful Rainbow Room at Port Alberni as well. So we're taking that little show on tour. Okay. And so uh, as you can see, I have to wear a wig to be Jim Morrison. <laughs> so it's not just leather pants that I have to put on, but uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yesterday's fate, they're a great band, by the way. Uh, I've had them on my show, obviously. Uh, yeah, good guys. Uh, well, tell everybody uh, again how we can find you. I'm sure you're on all streaming platforms, maybe, or uh, do you have um, 
like on YouTube, Facebook, you know, just tell everybody about that. Yeah. Yeah. Vince Worry official on, uh, on YouTube and, uh, Vince Worry the music on Facebook and, uh, Vince Worry think it's official on Instagram. I have to confirm that it's, uh, and, um, uh, you've got, uh, www.vincewarry.com. Um, and I am on all the streaming platforms too. Yeah. Okay. All right. So the recap, go to all those things he just mentioned to you, download his music and go to the site. You know, you can even obviously email him and talk to him there. I'm sure he would be uh, flattered to talk to you and, uh, he would love you for that. Absolutely. And, uh, our song this time, it's going to be called, uh, I'll Never Be. Uh, That's right. I'm sure it's self-explanatory, but uh, tell us a little bit of the story about that song. We'd love to hear it. Uh, so a song I wrote uh, back in the late 90s with my original band in Vancouver called uh, Obscene Silence. And um, it was like the dawn of the home recording um, era. I believe we were using a Roland 8-track um, digital unit. And um, we lugged that thing all over the house. And one of the highlights of the of the track, I mean, I like to think it's a pretty uh, pretty good song, you know, in terms of one of my better compositions. But um, we hauled that thing up and plunked it on my mom's grand piano. And um, the the bassist keyboardist in um, Obscene Silence, a fellow by the name of Greg Williams, who's musical endeavors include um, ambient pressure and uh, um, a few other projects. He's a, he's a multi-talented instrumentalist and still a good friend of mine. And uh, Greg just nailed the piano for that song the day that we did it. By fluke, my mom's piano had just been tuned. So that actually fit with the song because that can be a problem when you're using it like a real piano. Mm -hmm. Uh, and uh, the backing vocals were done really well by um, our drummer and also acoustic guitarist, uh, Kevin Tickham. So those stuck with me as strengths of the track. And uh, when I um, decided to re-record it, um, my producer and guitarist, Jim, he rearranged it, which was mind-blowing, the way he uh, he came up with a new arrangement for it. Um, I was really happy with that. And then, of course, he's a master producer. Um, and uh, we were really lucky to get Greg to come back and do uh, an updated but still true to the original piano part, because as I said, Greg and I are still friends. Um, we played in bands after Obscene Silence, too. And um, with a bit more knowledge of today's uh, recording systems and of course jim uh, running an amazing studio we we did the backing vocals that were sort of similar to the original and the whole thing just came out really i'm really proud of it okay well, well it's a great song by the way and Thank uh, you. and i know everybody out there i think you're gonna love this song too and uh we'll get to that in a second but uh vince we appreciate you coming back uh you know you're always welcome here if you want to plug something new so just let us know and we'll have you back absolutely on. appreciate it thank you so much Okay, and here All it right. is. I'll never be, and it begins right now. Try so hard to convince me you, you You know full well Soon the truth will come And all those bad traits Shine like the sun And she said You're so easy to love Thank you but I'll never be a lonely man She said your love like the sun Thank you But I'll never be a bright man She said you and I Are eternity Thank you But I know what six months is Yeah Alright I'll never be
the bus stop I'd drive by like I never knew your name I wish I could tell you one last thing I was just as confused as you and I've got no one to blame and she said you're so Somebody new Try so hard To convince me you were you You know full well Soon the truth will come And all your bad traits Shine like the sun And she said You're so easy to love Thank you but I'll never be a lonely man She said your love is like the sun Thank you, but I'll never be a bright man She said you and I are eternity Thank you, but I know what six months is